All right, how's it going, everybody? Welcome back to the channel. Today, I wanted to do a, a real quick update on the shop. So we've got, um, of course, our new shop that is on our new property. <laughs> this is only a fraction of it. It actually goes over the hill. We're eventually going to build our house up here on the on this hill in the woods. Um, but it, there's a lot to it. You'll see it pretty soon here. But here is the shop. Um, we've got the... Uh, the battle wagon, the battle-born Lance camper over there, chilling. Uh, but I uh, just want to give you an update. So this is a 30 by 40 metal building. Really happy with the build. Uh, two 10 by 10 doors. Just got the doors on um, this last week. You can see no electricity in here yet. Uh, been running everything off a generator. Um, no water, but we are plumbed and uh, we are ready for, uh, for electricity. Let me tell you, I'm ready for the uh, utilities. But um, so far, all we've got is a bunch of stuff and uh, a work in progress. So, you know, of course, we've got um, one of the boats in here. This is the Sweetwater boat that's um, been hanging out. Uh, the, the tour boat, is actually in the shop right now getting you know worked on just the end of season you know work that that has to be done every single day or every single year rather um so right now we're rocking the the, the sweet water boat i just actually got back from basswoodelectronics.com up in knoxville we were putting on the active target on this unit so we've got two lorance lives um so yeah so we are ready to go fishing uh, but I haven't been fishing because I've been here at the shop. Uh, essentially, what we're going to do is you can see we're starting to frame out, you know, this wall right here. Uh, eventually, we're going to put some uh, tongue groove pine uh, up here. We're going to put some kind of Wayne Scott, uh, you know, um, uh, baseboards down there. Uh, I just got these shelf systems put in, which I'm really excited about. Got, got you know, my Battleborn batteries and the batteries that I put back in the boats at the end of the year over there. But yeah, so we got the, the, the shelf systems going up. I think we're gonna put another shelf system over here. Um, one specifically for just apparel. I've got a lot of, of clothes that I need to, uh, um, you know, organize and lots of hats got a lot of hats and I got to find a, a really slick way to, to keep those organized and stored. Um, but the big project is this wall right here. Um, I, you know, I, I really want to get this framed out and, and uh, create that wall. I'm going to actually put insulation in there because eventually this will all be tongue and groove at, at some point. But first we're going to be doing this because we're going to be putting a slat board uh, on those two panels. So that's gonna be a ton of slat board, a lot of, of uh, opportunity for really organizing my Z-Man baits and other things as well. Um, but overall, this is, the, this is the shop so far. Pretty excited about it. The one thing I'm, I'm a little bit bummed about is, you know, I asked, you know, a, a people in a, in a post, you know, what would you put in your shop? And early on, one of my considerations, one of the things I wanted was a drain but i was advised against it um uh by you know my my contractor just because of bugs and things like that we've got a lot of scorpions in this area a lot of different bugs so you know having them come through the drain that's just kind of something that that he said you know you probably shouldn't shouldn't do so followed his his uh <clears throat> lead on that one don't have any drains in here but i really don't think it's going to be that big of an issue We've got, you know, of course the bilge and when that empties, I can put, you know, a tub under that if I really wanted to keep things super dry. But otherwise I think things dry up pretty quick. I never had a problem in my other garage. So may have made a mistake on that one. We will find out, but so far I'm very, very happy with the way things are going. Of course, we got to get some really killer lighting in here right now. It's just, you know, kind of gloomy and dark. Um, but we're gonna we're gonna get some really good stuff. Another thing I'm really excited about is getting you know some shop equipment. Got a nice 410 jack for the dually, um, jack stands, things of that sort. Uh, you know everything that's gonna help me uh, be a little bit more efficient and work on my gear in the garage is very very welcome. So 
Uh, if you have any guys have any suggestions uh, for me as I as I progress through this this whole process, um, please drop a comment below. Otherwise, I'm just going to keep you updated as to what I decide to add to this garage. It's really exciting to have a shop that I can I can add things as I go and really customize it to to how I like it. So, really really stoked. Um, Anyways, thank you guys for watching. Make sure you like, share, subscribe. I'll see you on the next video and out on the water.